everybody. My name is Louis. I'm a musician working with the Southwest branch of Live Music Now. Uh, usually with Live Music Now I would be out visiting care homes, hospitals, schools, uh, memory cafes as well. Of course at the moment uh, we can't be doing that but I am very happy to be able to make this video and bring some music from my home here in Devon uh, to wherever you are. Uh, maybe I've met some of you before, uh, perhaps not, but either way I hope you enjoy the music and maybe you'll get a chance to uh, join in with some of it in a bit as well, which would be nice. I'm going to begin with a piece of music on the guitar here, and this is an old Irish harp tune called Shibeg Shimor. <laughs> Thank you very much. So as I said, that was an Irish tune. Uh, it was written by a composer called O'Carolan, who lived from 1670 to 1738, I think, so quite a long time ago. And he travelled all over Ireland, visiting big houses and making lots of friends and writing lots of music. And there's hundreds of his tunes which survive now. And that's one of his more well-known ones. Uh, I'll play another one of his later on. For now, uh, though, I'm going to continue with something that's uh, a bit more local, for me anyway. So as I said, I'm in Devon, and the song I'm going to sing now is a song from Devon, and it's set very nearby here, on the south coast, in a place called Slapton Sands. And it's about the smuggling that used to go on uh, in this part of the world, and down to Cornwall, across the Channel, over to the Channel Islands and Brittany, and Normandy and other bits of France as well. So this is the smuggler. If you have a shaker or a drum or something at this point, this would be a nice time to pick it up. 
and because uh, we have quite a nice strong beat in this song. Uh, or you can just tap your feet, clap your hands, whatever you like. So, if we get a nice beat like this going. Perfect. So I'd like to introduce another instrument to you now. I'm going to put my guitar down and pick this up. Now this is an instrument called a sittern, and that's spelt C-I-T-T-E-R-N. It's not a sitar, the Indian instrument, which some of you might be thinking of. It's a different one again. I'll show it to you here so you can get a look at it. Despite the shape being quite different from a normal guitar, it's actually not so different after all, but it does have ten strings as opposed to the six that we have on this one here. And what gives it its very distinctive sound is that they're tuned in pairs, so I have five pairs of strings. I'll give you a little uh, listen to what that sounds like. So because the strings are tuned in pairs, that makes them resonate together and gives it a very resonant quality to the instrument. Um, I'm going to play you another piece of music by the composer O'Carolan, and this is one of his tunes which is called O'Carolan's Draft.
Thank you very much. Uh, I'm going to continue with another tune on the sit-own, or a couple of tunes actually. Make an adjustment here. I'm going to play you two tunes which are a kind of jig that are called slides. And these come from the west of Ireland. And you, you'll probably recognise these as sounding quite Irish, quite Celtic. So this is the Scattery Island slide and Miko Russell's. Actually, the other way around. Miko Russell's and Scattery Island slide. And again, if you've got a shaker or something at this point, it'd be a great, great time to get it going. Once again, we have a nice steady rhythm for this one. So, like this. finish up now with the last song of this video. I'll just put my sit turn down and pick up my guitar and I'm going to sing a song called the Mingalay Boat Song and it's set up in the Hebrides, the Outer Hebrides in Scotland. And once again I could do with a little bit of assistance with this. Usually at this point in the proceedings I would hand out this instrument to somebody and uh, this is called an ocean drum and uh, you might be able to see inside it's full of lots of tiny little ball bearings and when I rock it backwards and forwards like this it makes the sound very like waves crashing on a, on, a, on a beach. So I might actually attempt to play that myself and the guitar and sing at the same point so that would be amusing. Um, once again if you have any shakers you can make a sort of soft noise with well these are really good, something like this. Shells. 
uh, and imagine yourself walking on a shingly beach in the Outer Hebrides. Try and get that kind of feeling going on with your sound effects. So if you want to get that started now, shingly shells, that kind of sound, I'm going to start with uh, some of the ocean drum. And hopefully you have the lyrics for this as well. Maybe, maybe you don't. Maybe you do. Great if you do. Um, and if you want to join in with the chorus or any of the rest of the words, then please do. That'd be great. I'll sing the chorus round a couple of times when I start singing, so you get an idea of the, the tune. Here we go. Thank you very very much for listening thank you for playing along thank you for singing and i hope to meet you in person sometime if i haven't before all the best thank you <laughs>